Hi there, today we're going to look at the two new room generator functions. Open the modeling menu. Use the normal mark command up here. Click use. And now we're going to mark a box where we want to generate some uh, random rooms. And I'm going to move over here. See this nice box is now selected. Um, right now gravity is off, so um, we can we can build this in midair. Uh, let's see, maybe something like this. And when we are happy with the size of the box, we'll click M again and use the room generator one. Click use, and now I have to select a block um, which to um, generate the rooms with. Well, let's use this uh, number six over here, and we have some rooms here. We can click again on the left mouse button. Maybe this area is a bit too small, so I'm just going to select, mark again, click use. It's, gonna, it's just going to expand this area a bit. Mm, maybe like this. Something like that. And we're going to generate again. Like that. And as you can see, there's a lot of random rooms here. And I can click again. And Every time I click on the left mouse button, it will generate new random rooms. And as you can see, they are all uh, connected. Um, when I'm happy with uh, generated rooms, I click the right mouse button. And here you go. And as I said, uh, right now gravity is off, so this won't fall down. Usually, you won't, of course, you won't generate rooms like this in midair. Um, you'll generate them on the ground and maybe build some roof on top and, and stuff. Um, we can also generate the rooms uh, inside a mountain. Let's move over here. It's a good spot. Let's say we want to have a hidden room system in here. So again, we choose mark. We basically go and select here. And now we need to go and select the other end of the box. Let's make this really uh, huge. So we'll just move all the way over here. This was maybe a bit too big. Very, very tall. We can always look at the top and see how big these um, rooms are going to be. How, bi how big this area is going to be. Mm, still a bit. Uh, let's move down here. even move in here maybe maybe like this all the way down here up again still it's a bit as we can see there's 18 blocks tall so let's move down a bit 13 maybe 10 yeah 10 seems to be fine so now we have 106 by 10 by 508 so quite a huge area let's go room generator one and use and right click so we can see here a corner of it I'm just gonna I'm just gonna drill in make a hole because now all these rooms are inside the mountain so let's just drill in here a bit further and we can find a good place to sort of make the the entrance to this um, cave system room system so maybe let's just kind of get some light <coughs> mm -hmm. need to find the first room well, any room here. So here we go. So we could make a uh, sort of a pathway out here, make it nice and and so on. Maybe put a door here or something like this. And as you move in here, of course, you have to make it nicer. Eventually, you will come into this area. It's quite dark, so let's just 
cheat a bit and turn light all over like this and here you can see the the room the system ah we accidentally hit uh, some rail railroads here but anyway you get you get the point you can basically have rooms and mazes and stuff like this inside a mountain and make a big um, system um, we could we could um, put some could put some uh, torches here for example like, uh, to make it nice like this so um, let's, let's disable all the light again the cheat light and get the, the real lighting back like that so so anyway we have all this all these rooms in here and um, and we, of course we can make more rooms, rooms above and interconnect them with stairs and, and uh, everything. Okay, let's um, respawn. There's also another type of uh, room generator we could use. Um, again, I'm just going to use do this in uh, midair so you can um, see the the difference. Here we go, Mark. Going to put it uh, here gonna fly over here and put the other end again uh, for example um, yeah this this may be a bit too tall um, maybe like this seems uh, seems f maybe want to have it a bit a bit wider Like that. This seems this is fine. And this time we're gonna choose the room generator two. And again, need to uh, select a block to uh, generate with. And we could, for example, we could choose this one. Maybe um, looks like this. Let's choose a nicer one. Uh, maybe like that. And. like this again every time I click the lef left mouse button it will um, generate a new set of rooms interconnected rooms so anyway maybe I'm happy happy with this uh, setup and I'll just right click and it will paste the rooms into the world so here they are of course now we can do ceilings so we can you know um, make stairs and lamps and maybe I want to put in um, Maybe I want to put in a door. Let's just get rid of some of these. Bricks here. Like that. And um, put a door here. So, like that. There you go. Of course, um, all these uh, the bricks and the floor and everything can be changed with the normal tools. Just select an area like this, and we can do fill or we can do replace. Let's do uh, let's do replace. So I want to replace this block with uh, what we want. can put something else on the floor. Maybe, um, maybe, 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 maybe this brown, dark one. Yeah, looks nice. So this room now has nice floor here. Okay, thanks for watching.